each wall has a story and from the very first wall it's was apparent that it's not only about you know painting the mural but it's about how people came together at each of these mural projects everybody contributed something to it The idea was to paint 12 murals in eight cities in eight weeks. We started in Anchorage, Alaska. We wanted to start up in, in Alaska and then work our way all the way down the west coast now of the United States. We also wanted to include Vancouver, Seattle, Oregon, California, and even down to Mexico, Mexico City, and then a final mural at the Reno Aventura in Mexico City for the release of Keiko. The mural that really meant the most on this West Coast tour was the mural that I was to paint for the release of Keiko, Free Willy, at the Reno Aventura Park where he had been held. And there was a lot of talk about where Keiko was going, but nobody had really finished trying to obtain his release. Uh, I know there was a lot of naysayers in the early days. People would say, well, how could, you know, painting a whale on the side of a building save it? And I said something like, these animals have been in these oceans for millions and millions of years and they really don't have a voice. And I, in some small way, felt that, that if I did a mural of Keiko for the park, they would release him in a certain amount of time. What do you think about that, the wall and, and Keiko, a wall for Keiko? Well, I, I am very happy. I am in all the trainers and, and Keiko also because we need that kind of attention for Keiko. We, we need a, a better home for him. So I think this will help him a lot, yeah. a lot. And all the people um, in Mexico, we don't have a lot of information about these kind of animals. So it's, it's great for a while to come here and try to show, show uh, Mexicans about uh, their size or their, um, their, their species. And the people who can guarantee us, okay, the best habitat for Keiko, that moment, you know, Mr. Wyland and the people from Reina Ventura will start on a venture, okay, to take Keiko wherever he's going. There was talk about Keiko going to the Oregon Coast Aquarium where I had just painted a mural in Newport. I thought that was a great idea any place but Mexico City in this small pool where Keiko was. And Keiko and I really bonded. It, it sounds kind of strange, but we really had a connection and we really felt something uh, for each other and that made it extremely easy for me to paint a, a life-size portrait of Keiko swimming free on the wall at the front entrance of the Reno Aventura. They knew that they couldn't have this whale anymore due to his health issues and other issues political but they felt by having the mural it would uh, continue the spirit of this whale that was so much loved around the world. When the mural was done it really did uh, represent that beautiful animal that uh, I fell in love with. When we left, we felt really good that uh, we played a, a minor role in securing the release of Keiko.